Hey there friends and welcome back to Strange Rebel Gaming. I'm Brianna White and today we'll be playing through some more Final Fantasy VII Remake. Isn't this game amazing? What else can I say? Nothing. So, let's get on to the gameplay video. Enjoy! So we smash the boxes, we look around for goodies, nothing in here. Nothing in here. Wait a minute. This is definitely where we came from, unless there's another area like this. So, <laughs> turning right back around. <laughs> okay, now we're going the right way, I think. they It all does look kind of similar, so I wish I hadn't have had to stop the stream where I did, but okay. Now we're going down the ladder. Hopefully this is the right way. <laughs> we'll soon find out. Let's see what the map says. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. We're, we're doing all right here. Are there gonna be any baddies in here? Wait a minute, is this door open? That seems like it leads somewhere. Oh, wow. Excellent, Brianna. This looks looks like it leads somewhere. Shocking. We're gonna kill you for sure. I'm pretty good at protecting myself, you know. Ah, there's lots of these rats. Okay, let's see if we can remember how to play this game. Let's use a little bit of a star shower on these rare rats. And some blizzard, just for fun. Feeling chilly? That's that. And that's that. It was very Worked simple and sweat. easy. Oh, stinky Tifa. So, now it's time to take the takes. Two orbs of gravity. Do we know what those do? Let's see, orbs of gravity, orbs of gravity. Reduces HP of enemies within range by 25%. Okay, that's really decent. I love that, but am I gonna remember to use it is the question. Survey says no. Okay, so now we'll go through this door and see what we can get going here. Ooh, crabs. Don't want those. Piece of cake. Get him. Uh, looks like they're weak to magic. Oh, that's looking like some poison right there. Oh, they just keep discharging. All right, let's try a little bit of a star shower on you. And uh, for Aerith, because I'm pretty sure they would be weak. Oh, let's use our familiar! Because we're using on... What do you think of this trick? We're working on... Um... Can we lock onto one of these, please? This one's for you! As far as the familiar, we're working on our proficiency in that. So it's going to be good to use that as much That's as possible. Let's use a cure on ourselves. Because we just had a bench, so I doubt we're going to get another bench that soon. Okay. Did that. So now what? More baddies to defeat? Any rats in here? Wait, this room is looking very familiar. Why does this room look the same as the other room? The only, 
The only way that I could know that this room is any different is because there were boxes at the end of this one and a treasure chest at the end of the other one. <laughs> okay, some beasties there. Some beasties everywhere. Ooh, it looks like we could go either way. So for now, let's go left and see what it gets us. Leave this to me. I don't think so. I love Tifa with her first strike. That's great. Okay. That'll do. Stop fighting me, please. Oh, let's get you down first because you put people to sleep, and that bothers me. One more shot. It's over. Magic up, materia improved. Let's do it. Love that. Okay. So there's definitely some stuff on the other side of this. Ooh, a take. Oh, and a Sahagan looks like, but we can't get there this way. So instead of going through that corridor which I don't know, that looks like it goes down. So let's try going this way and see what that gets us. And hopefully we don't get too lost. I'll protect you. I'm pretty good at protecting myself, you know. That's right, she is. Let's get the sleep one first. Let's get a star shower. Oh no! Told you Tifa was gonna be put to sleep. Don't catch a gold. And wow, Aerith's amazing. Would kill for a shower. Stinky Tifa. Uh, do we not have prey on Aerith right now? Because that is a problem. Oh, it's a two ATB. That's why you can't use it when you're not in combat. Because we do have prey on her. Yeah, okay. All right, that's fine. But we have cleansing on magnify. Interesting, I haven't used cleanse at all, not once. <laughs> so instead we would just have to use all of our MP. Oh, Aerith's doing good for now, all right, okay. All right, so then let's just keep doing a cure. Just on Tifa and Aerith, because they have pretty low HP and compared to Cloud, who has over 3,000. Okay, so then this also seems to lead down. So my, my, what I suspect is that this leads down into this area, this leads down into this area, and it's all connected, maybe? So we'll see. Wait a minute. I need that. How do I get it? I don't know if that's the way. Oh my goodness. This is gonna take a while of me just running back and forth trying to figure out how to get this, isn't it? This is just like when they had the... When they had in the... Where you were running around trying to turn all the lamps off, whatever that's called. Actually, this was really easy, just kidding. It's not really a maze. Warding materia! And what does that do? Warding materia grants resistance to the linked materia's status ailment. Works with poison, time, bind, and subversion materia. Okay. Okay. So, like, if you're fighting against a robotic enemy that uses lightning, well, because it's a ro robot, <laughs> because it's a robot, because it's robotic, it's also weak to lightning. So what you would want is to link warding to lightning materia 
and then you would both be resistant to it and you'd be able to use it. That's great. No, you can't do that because it's only with poison time bind and subversion. So what's the point? If, if an enemy uses poison, it's not going to be weak to poison. So then it's really only good for, because it doesn't even work for sleep. So it's really only good for resistance and not offensive. I don't love it. I don't love this materia anymore. I thought this was gonna be really great, but it's not. So I don't love it, <laughs> but we have it. And so that's something. Okay, so we did that. There's nothing going on in here. And this leads to what? Let's end this quick. Not Get him! No, we focus on you first. So let's use a spell, let's use blizzard. Don't catch a cold. <laughs> Let's get some Tifa. Mm, yeah, let's get some Tifa. Star shower, work on that proficiency. Ow! Rude. Why is this so hard? This one's for you. It's weak to ice, right? No, weak to fire, okay. But I spell rapidly fill their stagger gauge, so we're gonna do it anyway. I think we're almost done. Don't I have something that's like does great while they're staggered? Weapon ability learned! Acquired the star shower ability! Love it. It's dead. Yeah, it's Ready? it's super dead. Alright. Star shower. Nailed it. Okay, so Aerith could use an ether. And then could cure herself. All right, so where does this go? Oh, okay, this is a dead end. Excellent. Okay, so we'll take the take. Take. Pair of revival earrings. Sure, are these boxes for smashing? They are, oh, look at all that good stuff. Smash those boxes, look at, wow, look at all those high potions. There were so many of them. Wow, I almost missed those boxes. I would have been sad. Okay, so that was a fun little dead end. So then, back down here. Okay. So we went from here to here to here. And then we go back up here, here, to go down wherever this area is. Okay, it's not that mazy. It's really not that bad. Easy. Go on! Easy. <laughs> oh, Tifa's asleep. Oh, look at this rat! Gotta go for it now. Is Tifa still asleep? Yeah, she is. Come on, Cloud, make yourself useful. Wow, Aerith just destroys all of them. Just destroys them. I love Aerith, she is so amazing. Tifa's sleeping on the job and Aerith is just killing rats everywhere. Am I going the right way? Yeah, okay. Did I go that way already? Yes, that's how we got here. Okay. Just double checking. All right, Tifa. Since you have first strike, let's see if you can get something good in before you fall asleep this time. Nope, you're asleep. Okay. Where's the, the sky? There you are. Go ahead with a fray. Okay. 
And then we got to use the ATB for prey, which is perfect. Okay, now we head on down this direction. And we head on down this direction. And what is through this door? A bench? No bench. But boxes, smash. And what is through this door? Door number two. More Look, sewers. That must be the way out. <laughs> Sewer I'm system. Wondering. There must be some way we can lower the water level. That sounds like a puzzle. Enter puzzle, but first smash the boxes. Great. Love. Okay. Bring it on, puzzle game. Mm-hmm. Guys, check it out. Seventh Heaven's water tank has something similar. I'm betting we can use this to control the sewage level. Hey, Cloud. You want to give it a try? This ought to drain the water. Right? Let's give it a try. And what happens? No mm. luck? Must be busted. A red light indicates a blockage, apparently. We can use the hand pump to clear the blockage. Sounds about right. I remember having to do this at the bar before. All right, I'll... Aerith, you mind giving me a hand? Cloud, you stay put. Keep an eye out for more red lights. Wait, I'm not sure... Trust me, this is the best way to handle it. We'll be back soon. <gasps> Tifa and Aerith on a mission together. It's gonna be awesome, I'm really excited. I wasn't expecting this. We're gonna go clear those blockages with some hand pumps. That's what we're doing. Uh, okay. So maybe this is a little different from the one at the bar. Is this is a timing or game. Industrial? How to operate the wastewater pump. Have Aerith open the valve by tilting L. The needle will start to swing from left to right. Have Tifa work the pump. While the needle is moving, repeatedly hit X to expand the target range. Then have Aerith close the valve as the indicator hand swings back to the right. Tilt L down within the target range to close the valve. Okay. Open. Increase pressure and. Whoops. Okay. Try to stay in sync. <laughs> oh, too early. Okay, I get it now. Keep calm. Okay. All good. Oh, so it's cumulative. All right. Perfect. Okay. Spectacular. Spectacular. Oh, we get, we have to do it three times. Okay. It's a little dramatic, I'll be honest. Could have gone better. <laughs> This, <laughs> this is a little silly. I'm always going early, okay. All right. Try to stay in sync. Yep, I get it. This is so annoying. Okay, and there we go. Okay, two. That went well. <laughs> Did it, Aerith? Okay. Did it go well? <laughs> this 
This is such a, just, this feels like it's just wasting my time. If it was even fun, it'd be one thing, but yikes. <laughs> Could have gone better. Oh, there's not even some goofy music to push you forward. I'm like, if this was, if this had hip hop del chocobo, de la choco, what is it? Hip hop de chocobo? If hip hop de chocobo was playing okay, in the background, it'd be a little bit more fun. Wonderful. But this is. Okay, let's head back. Ugh. Cloud's probably getting worried. Okay. But teamwork! <laughs> All right, go for it, Cloud. Oh, you're gonna make Aerith do it? Useless. What was he in here this whole time for anyway? All right. Moving on. Nicely done. We make a great team. Go team. Go team. <laughs> That's really cute. All right. So, basically we nailed it. Anything fun in this room? Not really. You're dead. Whoa! Who's dead? Oh, Sahagi. That's interesting. It didn't have Aerith lead that this time. It's really weird. All right, let's get some fire going. Oh, definitely on you. Let's get Tifa doing some star shower. Going in. Aerith, could you please? Stagger the other one with a very powerful blizzard. Gee, thanks. Wow, leveled up and material. Luck up and materia improved. How exciting. We nailed it. Now, the question is since we leveled up, do we have anything fun to do? No? No. Nothing fun to do. Okay, put the water levels down, so down we go. Leave this to me. Smash. Boy. Let's see. I feel like I want to fight his teeth up for a little bit. Just for fun. Whoa! I feel like that was much more powerful than I was expecting. Let's do this right. I feel like that didn't recover as much HP as it should have. Use a cure on Tifa this time. That's the real problem with Tifa is. She's just so squishy. Worked up a good sweat. Always, Tifa. Don't you always work up a good sweat? Smash this box. Smash this other random single box. I'm guessing we have some more battles heading our way because the battle music didn't hang out or didn't stop. Sure is nice to go up for a change. Hope the pillar's not much further. She's talking about sewers, right? Oh, I don't 
want Cloud to die. It's on you. Oh, ah! Let's go. <laughs> Bring it. Yeah. Uh, what if we used a potion to fix Cloud and then switch to Aerith? I got this. So that she could build up her prey. <laughs> yeah. All right, that was the right call. There we go. Okay, let's lock onto one of them and start damaging all of them. Come on. What the oh, two in a row. They're like uh, dive bombing dragoons. Gotta heal first. It's gonna be a lot better if we can just get them all staggered. Oh no! I'm a toad! Oh no! I'm a toad! Oh no! Look at me! Flopping around as a toad with a ribbon on! Okay, that was fun, but I don't want to die. Um... Yeah, she's gonna be a toad for a little while longer. I'm waiting. Give me your best shot! Alright, they got it. I'm gonna go back to Aerith being a toad. Look it! Look at her toad with her little ribbon! She's so cute! Bubble breath! Oh my gosh, it's so cute! What does it do? the cutest thing I've ever seen in my life! What do those bubbles even do? Oh, she's so cute! Okay. Uh, we gotta maybe heal up a little bit here. Oh, that was really cute. Okay, that's not gonna do anything. Maybe there's a bench nearby. I'll go on ahead and secure the exit. Mm, I don't think there's a bench coming up. We still got battle music. So what we're going to do instead... Okay, focus. We're going to cure with Tifa, do a little cure with Cloud, and then just use an ether. Do one more cure for Cloud. Yeah, and then we'll just... Because... Because we have lots of ethers kind of a waste, but it's good to fill up. Okay, because I have a feeling we got we got a battle ahead of us. <laughs> Trailer scene! Looks like they're hungry for more. We're not delicious. Not even a little bit. Get going. No. Okay. I don't understand why Aerith leaves at that moment. Like, she's you too. fought all but this time. Too many of them. Not for me. Like why? Back off or die. I don't understand it. We're just gonna run from them anyway. What is the point of this? We fought them all this whole time together. Why didn't they just let us fight? I don't. What? What was that scene for? Does anybody else get that? Because there's too much, too many more of them? Or just because it's a trailer? Okay. I don't, I don't get it, but, all right. Oh, it's a chapter division. Okay, ooh, bench! It's a good thing I used a bunch of ethers. Or I used an ether to heal up right before this fight. There's a bench right there. Understood. <laughs> The avalanche mission's been proved. We ought to proceed as planned. <sighs> this is bullshit. What the hell are they thinking? Threats to public order are to be summarily put down. This is what we've always done. Summarily put down. It's a little late to grow a conscience. Oh, what a great scene. 
both of them had to think for a second and be like, are we doing the right thing here? Both of them. You saw it in their expressions. That's really good. Don't worry, we'll make it in time. Hmm. Also, did you notice that the line was threats to public order must be summarily put down, not threats to public safety? Just a quick note. But now, Bench. Sit on our bench and then check this potion machine out to restock. We have 5,000 gil now. Okay, so we could buy one expensive thing, but I don't know if that's the right call. Some materia. So these are the more expensive items. Wrist guards to increase strength. Survival to increase fight. Platinum earrings to increase magic power. By how much? 10%. A talisman to increase magic defense, which is spirit. Okay, so what does Aerith have right now? Oh, she's wearing the rebel bracelet. Okay, well, we have to have that on her. No debate there. So she's got the studded bracer. He's got an iron bangle. We don't have, I don't know when we're gonna see Barrett again, so we don't have him set up yet. Titanium bangle is 25 and 25. Oh, but he, this is his hmm, champion belt. What does that do again? Increases max HP, increases strength. Yeah, definitely keep that on him. Bulletproof vest is increases Vite by five, and the Spectral Cogwheel, consuming MP fills the limit gauge. We want to keep that for her. I really like that. But Tifa could definitely get the Bulletproof Vest, and I'd be happy with it. Do I want to spend all of my gill on it? That I don't know. I'm gonna say no for now, but we'll think on it and save up for some more stuff. Smash. Did they go up here? Did you go up here? We could get lost in here. This is the train graveyard, <gasps> a real treasure trove of scrap. Sector 7 should be just past that large maintenance facility over there. I vote we stay in the light so we can see where we're going. Dark, dark everywhere. Is that it? I'm so excited for this scene. Set of scenes. I'm so excited for this part of the game. Okay. Ooh, this music's so good it's too. It's and kind of creepy. People don't come around here often. And not just because of the monsters, but because of the stories. What kind? Everyone seems to think that the train graveyard is haunted. Those who lose their way out there in the dark of night will never, ever find their way back home again. <gasps> well, if is you call right? something a graveyard, you're kind of asking for that kind of story. It's not like I think it's true or anything. But, you know, it's... Just... Then let's hurry. Tifa trying to be brave. Okay. Can we go this way? Can we go this way? I feel like the urge to look in every single nook and cranny. Oh, there's rats. Easy. Kill the rats. Why is Cloud the leader of the fights again? Why did I triple s Oh, they were defeated Let's that go. quickly. Okay. How did Cloud get moved to the leader again? 
When did that happen? Oh, when Cloud joined the party again? Yeah, that makes sense. Okay. I wish it wouldn't reset itself all the time. But I, I guess I get it. Okay, so there's nothing really go- oh, well there's a ladder. Okay, so there's a couple different areas we could go into. It looks like this will lead us to the next area, so I think let's go through this way first. And explore everything there is to explore through here. Boxes to smash? Ooh, with creepy white handprints all over them. Smash them anyway. Okay, and what do we have here? More boxes to smash, of course. And a purple take! A mithril rod! What is Cloud's leg doing there? He's got a little restless leg syndrome going on! He's got a little, a little, uh, maybe he's been running too much, so he's got a little, uh, a twitch in his leg. He's got a little, <laughs> a little, uh, a little shiver going on in that leg. Okay, Mithril Rod sounds like an Aerith thing, and it is! But we're not proficient in Fleeting Familiar yet. Fire and Energy Burst that hits multiple times. Increased Stagger Damage Bonus costs two ATB. That looks awesome. Ray of Judgment. But we're gonna hang out with the Arcane Scepter, A, because it's a lot prettier, and B, so that we can hang out with our Fleeting Familiar. For now. Tempting. Tempting. Mm. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Okay, Cloud, can you stop with the weird twitch in your leg? Okay, so we did all that, and looking in this area, looking around here. Okay, so I think that's what the whole area was for that. Then we can go back up here and go up this ladder. Then the question is, well, there is no question. We go down, yeah, this way, okay. Make sure we look in every nook and cranny, as is the strange rebel way. <gasps> Guys, what was that? What was that? Oh, it's gonna like lock the camera in, so we have to move forward on it, okay. I have some boxes to smash, though. Ooh! Ooh, what are these guys? Oh, don't me like that. <laughs> what are they? Okay, let's cast Bleeding Familiar okay. so that we have it. <laughs> get him. Kinda hurt. Kinda hurt. Um... Ooh, we can use poison. Oh, that's cure poison. Yeah, that's cleansing. All right, no on that then. Let's try blizzard. They're creatures. They should be weak to blizzard. Feeling chilly? Proficiency bonus gained already! This one's for you! Well, that was quick. All right, so we already gained proficiency in our weapon. So we can already move on to the next one. Sweet. All right, let's try upgrading it. Right, let me just double check that, I, that that's correct. Wait, it says proficiency 90. Oh, so proficiency was increased, but it wasn't. Okay, all right, okay. We still have to hang out with this for a little bit longer. Proficiency increased, but not gained. Okay, that's fine. Prayer, magic up, elemental ice, 
healing. Yeah, okay, that's all correct. Okay. I think I just heard a little kid. Did you guys hear it too? Why would there be kids out here this late? What? And Tifa's so scared. Yeah, okay. Alright, so let's smash these boxes. Smash. Moogle metal. We got one. What's through here? Nothing. Great. Someone's there. Notice how the quest isn't called who's there. It's called someone's there. Okay. Okay. Spooky. More boxes to smash. Hmm, which way do we go? This way. And up here. And now what? Very sneaky. Ooh! Did you see that? That was a little orb. A little orb of light floating around. I saw that. Anything back here? No. Okay. Oh, creepy. Coming through. Out of our way. Where rat. One more shot. Another one of these. You guys are so easy. You don't even really need to do anything. Wow, look at all these handprints. Creepy. So let's take a look at this. There's like... It, they're almost like UV kids drawings, right? Like they're not even like scary. This is like a unicorn. This is like a... A ghost. It's like a frowny, tongue out rat. This is a mess that someone apparently walked barefoot through. This is a little, looks like a little ghosty with a baseball cap. He's like not mad, but he is like yelling or like spitting or something. This guy, this is a little, little eye, little flying eye. Ooh, there, what looks like that, like kind of floaty orb, orb thing. See what else here? Some more spill. This is a kind of a creepy crawly little guy. Okay. What about you? Oh, another like flying kind of ghosty bat kind of thing. All right. Oh, and Saturn. Hello. What about on here? Oh, why does this look like a little happy birthday ghost? Like he kind of looks like he's wearing a little birthday hat and celebrating. I don't know. He kind of looks happy. <laughs> Um, okay, so they're up there, but what's in here? Oh, a take! My instincts. One gill. Ooh, but we also got some creepy stuff. Wrong way. Look at that crying ghost. And a dog. What was the point of that one gill, though? I feel like it should have had something interesting in it, like an ether or something. Aren't ether like 20 gill? So I got 1 20th of an ether. So we drop down, so it looks like we're not going back. 
Got some creepy noise going on. Oop! Oh! That actually kind of surprised me. Feeling chilly? Use a little blizzard. Not bad. We're not doing too shabby fighting these little guys. Okay. Let's smash these boxes. Recovered some MP. I love to see that. Ooh, take. What do we have here? HP up materia. Hmm. I like it. Cloud's got one of those right now. Smash some more boxes. High potion and an antidote. Those were good boxes. I like that. Let's see. Is there anything? Yeah, I think we went through every area there. Very slow walking through this area. Ooh, look at that moon! Wow, why is it that it's almost creepier if you look up, right? Interesting. Anytime that you're walking slowly through a piece of game area, it's a hint that they want you to look around a little bit. Interesting. There's the warehouse that Tifa said we have to be on the other side of, so we're getting through this. Huh? What is that? Uh oh. And that right there, my friends, is where we're going to end today's episode. Please remember to like the video if you enjoyed it. I assume that you did. Remember to share the video with all your friends so they can enjoy it too. And of course. Please remember to subscribe and hit the notification bell for Strange Rebel Gaming so you don't miss the next video. Okay? That's all. I love you all. Bye!